Today we're going to go do one of the most iconic things in the whole of Bali. We're going to go to the Heaven's, Heaven's Gate. Gate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't play. Take your time. It's quite boring to be honest. Two, three, jump. So if you're new to the channel, I'm Lewis and this is Emma. We're traveling Bali at the moment. Right now we're in Chandidasa and we're gonna go head to the Heaven's Gate, one of the most popular attractions in all of Bali. Time to get on the way and see how busy the Heaven's Gate is in 2022. So we just arrived at the Gates of Heaven place. Uh, when we arrived, they sent us this way. We had to go to parking. We cannot go directly there. So we had to stop here in this parking area and pay 45K each to get a shuttle to go up to the top. Hi. Hi. Ready to go? I've got a yeah. ticket. Can I see? Made it to the top, got to buy some tickets for the actual temple now. Yeah. Can we have two tickets, please? 110,000. I'll get you a sarong. Okay. Balinese style. Uh, okay. Wow, yes, lovely. Mm-hmm. Hello. 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 What do you want? Mm -hmm. Should I get a black one? Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. He's just going to be boring and get black. You get this one, thank you. Oh wow, thank you. Baby before, huh? Yeah. And the left side uh, at the middle. Yeah. Don't climb. So we arrived at Lampuang Temple a bit after a bit of a detour. We managed to follow not Google Maps but the signpost and we ended up on some very rural roads that ended in a dead end. Balinese guy at the end said, turn back bro. <laughs> yeah. But finally we got here. Got our sarongs, 45k for the shuttle, 55 for the ticket to the temple. So we're on our way up now. Just scaling a mountain. Makasi. Later, the photograph call your number. Oh, okay. yeah. yeah. Take your time. Thank you very much. So we're waiting for our number to be called now. There was a short walk up. They offer you motor taxi for 5k, but it's like a two minute walk, so it was fine. We've got to wait for our number. It's quite busy here. How long have we been waiting? A while, but it's okay. We're on 199 and we're 226, so it's still a fair while. Yeah. Still waiting. <laughs> what Heaven's Gate is really like. How yeah. long has it been? Probably 30, 40 minutes already? Yeah, we had a little snack. Luckily, we brought a little pastry with us, otherwise, <laughs> I would be starving. And there's a loo back there, so that's great. Yeah. Is what you don't see behind the Instagram post. Yeah, hopefully it's worth it. Now it seems to be getting busier, but hopefully not too long, too much longer. Okay. It's quite boring to be honest. Yeah, thinking of playing the game. <laughs> So one thing you can do while you're waiting for your picture is to walk up some of these temple steps. There's a set of three, and when they explained the rules to us, they said you can't walk up the middle one, but you can walk up the two on the left and right. And there's a door at the end, they said don't open the door. This is something you could get some nice photos and get a little exercise while you're waiting. There's a nice view as well of the mountains, which is cool. <laughs> yeah, we might snap a few nice photos while we're waiting. I would definitely recommend walking these steps all the way to the top of the door because that is an insane view. Not sure which mountain it is, maybe Mount Agung, so I think it's higher than Mount Bato, but super amazing views, good for another photo shoot. Okay, get ready. One, two, three. Next pose. Another pose, another pose. Okay, the last one. Do you wanna jump? We're gonna jump. One, two, three, jump. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Next pose. I got it. Yeah. Next pose. Another pose. It's okay, he can go now. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. 
One, two, three. Next pose, another pose. One, two, three, jump. Another jump. One, two, three. I got it. Next pose. Yeah. Change the pose. Change, honey. Oh. Okay, the last one. No, we're good. How long do you have to stay to take photos? Uh, it's like a six hours. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> one, two, three. Not a pose. Like a second. Hey. Tiring and hot. So tiring. Yeah. yeah. It's so hot to you. What? So we finally finished our photo shoot. I reckon in the end, we probably waited around an hour and a half. Yeah, maybe even an hour and 45 minutes. So like only 30 people took an hour and a half. So we arrived at around 12. So that was maybe not the best time, a bit busy. And we say next pose and you can do around three if you're a couple or in a group and then three or four. I ran out of poses. You kept saying next pose. I was like, no, I'm, I'm, I'm good, I'm done. Yeah, can't believe anymore. <laughs> so inserting photos on the screen now. <laughs> So let me jump in to address the elephant in the room. When you see the photos like this on Instagram, unfortunately, they are fake. In reality, it looks more like this. The trick is the guy takes his phone and puts a mirror underneath the camera to get the reflection effect. I'll admit when I first saw the pictures, I thought, wow, you know, is it a super still lake? Is it glass or something? So it does feel a little bit, you know, not like the best kind of tourism. You go there for this very artificial photo, but I guess that's a bit of the Instagram versus reality of Gates of Heaven. <laughs> so it was cool. I mean, I'm sure those photos are really beautiful and it is one of the most iconic things to do in Bali. I think the wait is quite long and it's kind of, a bit like you do just come for the photo yeah and like lewis said earlier like we've seen loads of temples already which doesn't mean that it's not cool to check out new ones but i mean it's literally just for the photo i mean and because the, the other temples are like really far away it's around like 30 or 45 minute walk to each one mm -hmm. yeah so if you wanted to you could spend a lot longer here they said there's almost 3,000 steps and it would take you five hours to hike around the whole place so mm -hmm. i think that's not really for us but all of that is included in your ticket for 55k if you wanted to so that was our experience at the iconic Luampiyak, no, what is it? Uh, Lumpangyan. <laughs> Lumpangyan, Heaven's Gate Temple. So up to you to decide if the wait and the money is worth it. I think it is worth it. It's something you have to do if you're in Chandidasa or in Bali, one of the most iconic things. And we also want to see some other things in Chandidasa while we're here. So we're going to take you along. We're going to head off, get some lunch and see what's next. Yeah, so come along. So only 14 minutes away, we just arrived at Turn to Ganga and we're just getting a bit of lunch now, some sandwiches and cold drinks. So we decided to stop here at Turn to Ganga to get some lunch, but we figured, hey, we're in Chandidasa anyway, so we're gonna stay and check out Turn to Ganga, which is like a big koi pond and some nice gardens to check out, so. Yeah, let's go have a little wander around. The price to get in is 50,000, so it's not too expensive and I suppose you could stay here the whole day mm -hmm. if you wanted to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so let's go check it out. <laughs> Look at them. So fat. Which one's you, honey? <laughs> gobble, gobble. They're all so overweight, we think. <laughs> They've yeah. been overfed by all the tourists coming. Yeah, we didn't buy any fish food. No, we, they don't need any. Secret area. Now you be careful not to fall in. This one's a bit of a clumsy one, so watch the lily pads first and the GoPro second. So we're on the lily pads, we're actually walking against traffic, so at some point we're gonna have to turn back. Yeah. But it's quite cool, a bit busy with some traffic over there, but nice experience, I think. It's quite relaxing after the old uh, Heaven's Gate. Yeah, a bit less busy.
Put it right in his mouth. <laughs> so they're a bit expectant, are they? Yeah, as you saw in the clip, <laughs> the fish literally just open their mouths as soon as somebody just stands over them. It's Same. a bit weird. <laughs> It's quite nice though, it's definitely busy. There's a bit of traffic. There's like some lily pads and there's some traffic because there's one <laughs> spot that everyone wants to photo. So people are just standing on the lily pads, just waiting. Yeah, it's not as... <laughs> Just to take the step and get to the photo spot. It's not as organized as Heaven's Gate where you have your number that's called out. This is just like survival of the fittest. Yeah, so. <laughs> cool. so what do you think of your second time at Tirta Ganga? Yeah, it's nice. It's less busy this time than it was the first time I came, obviously, because that was before COVID. But yeah, it's quite nice. It's relaxing. It's a little bit, you know, you pay 50k just to take a photo, like Heaven's Gate. But it is still nice to see something definitely to check out if you're in Chandidasa. Mm -hmm. What did you think? Yeah, I thought it was cool. It was my first time here. It's still quite nice. The gardens are quite beautiful and there are a lot of koi. I mean, it's a bit of a tourist trap to get you to buy some fish food and do the pictures, but and so it's a bit busy, but otherwise it was nice. So yeah, that was our one day in Chandidasa, going to Heaven's Gate and then to Ganga to see the koi pond. I think that's quite a good way to do it. It's a bit of a drive from where we were on the coast in Chandidasa. It was about an hour to drive to Heaven's Gate and about an hour to get back. So a bit of a trek, but overall it's a good way to do Chandidasa, I think. Yeah, we had a really nice time. So if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to see even more Bali content. Yeah, we're going to be exploring more Bali over the coming weeks. So don't yeah. forget to stay tuned and we'll see you in the mm -hmm. next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.